examine the role of supermarkets in supply chain management of fruits, vegetables and food items. How do they eliminate number of intermediaries? Again, this question is a very uh, basic one and it has two parts. First part says, examine the role of supermarkets in supply chain management of fruits, vegetables and food items. See, this question is very much related to the food processing sector. So this time they didn't ask any direct question on food processing. They're asking you an indirect question, but the matter remains more or less the same. They're asking us, examine the role of supermarket. How does the supermarket say? How does it help? And the key word here is, mind you, the key word is examine. When I read examine, I thought I also need to provide not only the positives, but also the negatives. So I opened up the answer by uh, telling what is uh, supply chain management. What is supply chain management? I explained it uh, right since the production of a particular item until it uh, reaches through the intermediaries to the customers. The entire chain is supply chain management. And uh, then I tried to analyze positively the role of supermarkets. That the supermarkets are helping the farmers to connect to the larger audience, suppose in urban area. They are also taking care of the logistic and everything behind that. So those were the positive. But since the keyword was examined, I also tried to mention the negative. Ki how supermarkets, how they can have a negative impact. They can have some kind of a monopoly. Maybe the prices that they are paying, prices that they are paying might not be up to the mark. So some kind of negatives, whatever I could think of at that moment. And lastly, the question is, the sub part is, how do they eliminate the number of intermediaries? See, uh, if you underline the word intermediaries, intermediaries always have had a negative impact on this. See, we always say that an increasing number of intermediaries would actually, you know, draw the uh, money out of the pocket of the farmer, the more intermediaries there are. So I said, ki, uh, you know, if a person is actually connected, a farmer is connected to a supermarket, then he doesn't have to go for a farm gate sale, what we call it a farm gate sale. That going for sale of your item at your farm gate, this will not happen. And I also tried to list out key if intermediaries are not there, then the, uh, you know, the income of the farmers, the income uh, which is there with the farmers will also increase at some point. And maybe if the supermarkets directly actually link with the farmer, then every year they can ensure that there's some buyer for their products produced. So that is a positive thing for farmers. These are some of the things that I adequately concluded by saying that the food processing industry should also be promoted. Supermarkets should not only be taking only the raw, raw products, but they should also help the farmers in processing the food so that they can get better value for their products. Thank you.